Hey, it's me, Joey G, and today I want to talk about something that kind of angers me. Um, I have to explain this from the start to beginning because I am kind of mad about this, okay? So today, I decided I wanted to hang out with a straight guy, and yeah, we hung out. It was mad fun. We played games and did all this other stuff just... Just because we're cool like that, and I'm 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 friends with all straight guys. I love straight guys; they're just awesome, and they're not all about sex and stuff like that. Um, but today, we hung out. I walked him to the bus, and on my way back, I'm walking, and all these people are looking at me. I'm just like, okay, fine. I know I I I look different. I'm not your average boy. So, for some reason. I don't know what made me think this was okay. I walk down the street and I see this guy. He's on his bike and he starts talking to me. So I'm just like, hey, I'm going to talk to you too. I'm like, what's up? Hey, he's like, my aunt, my nieces live right around the corner and da 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 and da 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 da, whatever. And I'm like, cool. So then he's telling me about his beer and how he's drinking his beer and how he drinks so much and he gets drunk and stuff. So I'm just like, okay, whatever. Let that go. I'm just like, whatever. You, you do you. So then he asked me if I was doing drugs and all that. I was like, no, I don't do drugs. I don't do any of that. I'm a clean, healthy boy. Yes, I'm fat, but I'm a clean motherfucker. All right? Uh, all right. So as the time goes on, I realized that he's pretty much pursuing me, staying with me just to talk to me. And I'm just like, can you go somewhere? Thank you. Okay. I don't tell him this, but in my head, I was I was just like, motherfucker, move. <sighs> You're gross. So as time goes on, the motherfucker just drives in front of me. And I'm thinking he's just leaving. He goes up in front of me just a little bit. Stops. Starts drinking his beer. And I'm just like, okay, well, he's drinking his beer. He's just going to leave me alone. Hey, I'm fine with that. So, as I lay me down, as Whitney Houston would say, the street, he stops me again. And it's like, hey, um, come talk to me. I ain't got nothing to do. I'm like, okay, fine. Whatever. Here I go being stupid as I, as I motherfucking am. I'm dumb as hell. Not paying attention to what he wants. So he's talking to me. He's like, yeah, my nieces live there and I got this beer. I was like, bitch, you just fucking told me this. Shut the fuck up in my head. I didn't say this out loud. This just came in my head. So I'm just like, okay, whatever. I walk and again, he follows me and stays with me. I let him finish his beer. I'm just like, let's go again. I got to walk in. Start walking. Knowing damn well he has to turn a block before he keeps pursuing me. He doesn't just stop. He keeps going. So I'm just like, okay, now I'm alone. I'm a little bit scared. I'm just like, when's this motherfucker going to go? What is he going to motherfucking do? And then I realized I'm 10 times bigger than this bitch. And I'm 10 times younger than him. I'm 10 times strong, strong, stronger than this. Oh, that's special thing. Okay, whatever. 10 times stronger than this motherfucker. So I'm like, okay, whatever. I stop moving. He turns, or so I think he turns. I walk and <clears throat> get, I'm, I'm almost at my house now. And it's just like, yay, I'm gone from this motherfucker. And as I turn to go up my street, he comes up from behind me and is like, hey, yo. You gay, right? And I'm just like, yes. And, and I didn't say so, yes. He's like, no, 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 no. I'm not trying to be rude or nothing. I'm not trying to be disrespectful. And he's like, um, I'm like, okay, well, it's okay, it's fine. And he just goes, and he finally had the fucking nerve to say this. He said, oh, that's all right with me. I'm fine with that. Oh, so if you seem around, yo, you should let me hit that. Motherfucker, if you ever in your goddamn life come up to me like that, looking like a dirty old rat out of um, Ratatouille, don't you ever in your motherfucking life, if I see you again and you come after me like that, I will beat more than shit out of you. I will beat the alcohol, the drugs, and the age out of you. You'll be 20 years old by the time I'm done. 
looking like your hundred. All right. Thank you. If you ever in your fucking life come at me like that again, you won't have a life. All right. Thank you. And that concludes Joey G. Subscribe, motherfuckers. <laughs>